Well, here's something you can do in Lake Havasu on a warm day to cool off. Looks like something from outer space, Star Wars or whatever. Well, you could be doing this too if you travel to Lake Havasu. Christoph, come. And here's a shot of the harbor on the other side of the bridge from where we parked and the restaurant was. This is mainly where all the shops are. This is how you enter a kayak. Actually a wakeboard. Very good. Did that very well. Hi there. I guess we want to fly. That's Jack Russell. Or? No. What is that? What kind of? Jack Russell Jack Terrier Russell and a, uh, a trout. Oh, okay, mixed. Oh, yeah. yeah I've right. seen them before. They're great Yeah. Have yeah. yeah. fun. Okay. Okay. Let's go. It was such a pretty day. I thought uh, Christoph and I would take a nice little walk down the uh, area here at uh, Lake Havasu, on the bridge area. Beautiful day. The weather's about... Uh, Temperature's probably about 70, 75 degrees. A lot of people out running around. Not really crowded though. It's just just a nice number of people. Get to see all the sights and um, Christoph gets to take a nice walk. Jean's out shopping, so I thought this would be something good for us boys to do. And this is the uh, restaurant here where we ate. We ate that right on that patio there. And we had the uh, famous fish and chips. And here we are entering the uh, shop district again where all the shops are. Christoph wants to see if there's any shops that he may be interested in. Well, this bridge has quite a history to it. Interesting story. The bridge was taken down over in London and stored brick by brick and labeled in a warehouse. And Mr. McCullough from McCullough Chainsaws actually purchased it, bought it, had it shipped over here and uh, had it reassembled. Now, the Colorado River comes through here, but he didn't have it assembled right over the Colorado River, had it assembled over dry land and then dug a canal under it and that's what we're walking through now. The canal goes through here and goes back out to the Colorado River. Well we really enjoyed London Bridge. There's a lot to do down here. We spent I think three days here. Every day went downtown, ate a couple different restaurants, hit a couple different shops, took pissed off for a lot of walks. You can walk across the bridge and one really neat thing to do is you take a ferry boat ride that goes out to the other side of the California area which is a uh, casino out there. It costs, I think it was $2 per person to ride. So we rode out, it's about a half an hour ride out and it's the uh, same price, uh, the $2 included there and back. So you got to get off of the boat, go up, turn around, get back on. So we ended up with an hour ride out on the Colorado River on a beautiful day for two bucks. Can't beat that. It's a good shot walking right along the canal and London Bridge is right behind us. Here's a shot of a neat park that's on the left-hand side. They have all kinds of events right across from this uh, walkway where the uh, canal is. Christoph, Christoph, are you having fun? Huh? Are you having fun? Are you having a good time? Are you? I think he's having a good time. There's some neat looking palm trees. Lake Havasu Cruisers. They're going to have a little party tonight, DJ on that boat, and gearing up for a lively Saturday night. 
Got all the pontoon boats lined up coming in. This will be dark in about another probably 45 minutes. But you're one day out of a full moon. So it's going to be nice and bright down here. Looks like a lot of activity. Look at that. Isn't that cool? Guess a, a replica of a lighthouse. Well, you can tell he's not a water dog and ducks out there and he just could care less. He said, you don't think I'm going out there and swim and get them, do you? I'll sit here and look at them. But that's about it. Well, it's the sun sets on Lake Havasu. I hope you enjoyed the video. Don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell button below so you don't miss any episodes. Thanks for watching. Thank you.